some beauty talks with y'all so our faces are already beat so normally when i have people do the videos you know when we have our beauty chats we are usually doing our makeup mm -hmm. a face mask doing our hair or something like that but we are already ready for the day and we're not doing that right now so you guys are just gonna get us already made up paid up we both dropped instagram right pictures so now. make sure y'all show us some love on our instagram at excuse me beauty. go like and your girl i am just airy ah! so today video y'all we finna give y'all some tea okay Okay, listen. Gonna let y'all know what's going on. Let y'all know, because everybody be thinking that certain people, that people don't be going through stuff in their life, and we do. So, today's, like, talk is going to be about our first time getting cheated, cheated on. on. Like, ah. Uh, you got cheated on before? Yeah. Wow, this is going to be like a real story. Y'all yeah. going to be learning. She going to be telling me. I'm going to be telling her. Yes, y'all. Ah. Okay, so because I don't want no issues with nobody in the world, somebody trying to drop no videos and be on the shade room and everything, oh, I'm going to use different names. Different names. I'm going to use different names and that's just how it's gonna I'm going to keep all the key facts the same, but I will ch like, like slightly change a little bit stuff just to be safe because I just don't want no issues. But it's my story, so I'm going to tell my truth and what I know. Okay. okay? So, I go first? Or like, yeah, you could go first to see your channel. Oh, okay, okay. So, okay, so this, okay, so I got cheated on multiple times. But this is the cheated on that was just like, that took the icing off the cake. It was just, and I, it took, okay, so let me start from the beginning. So, it was a wonderful day. Uh-huh. And, um, we're going to name this person, um, Coco. Coco. So, me and Coco, we was in a little relationship. This the boyfriend? This is, yeah, this is the okay. boy. So, we and Coco, we got a little relationship on. We all happy. Everything's cool. And so, me and Coco had... Like, I don't know how to explain it. Coco's mom loved me. So, you know, when the mom loves you, you allowed to come over. My mom trusted us at the time. So, you know, we was allowed to hang out, everything like that. So, this one time, me and his sister was really close. And this one time, I texted I texted him. I'm like, hey, um, I'm not going to be, like, I'm not going to be home because we went out of town for, I think maybe it was, like, Christmas time or something. And so, y'all know when y'all go out of town, I was in Indiana. So, when I went back to Michigan, I'm like, I don't know when I'm coming back home. I'll probably be back after, like, New Year's, you know, when school's back up. So, you know, but I really was coming home early, and I was going to surprise him. So I surprised him. I did tell him, so I'm like, yeah, I'm not going to come. I'm calling him and everything, so it looks probably like, like I'm, yes, she ain't yeah. coming. I'm going to go fuck so with my husband. So it looks like I'm still in Michigan. Like, I got it all set up to look like I'm still in Michigan. You know how we do it, ladies. You know, it's a way to make it. Yeah, so. But I feel like you be low-key trying to find, like, see what they doing. Like, yeah. sometimes I'll come home early just to see what's playing doing, like, you got going on What's going here. on today? Just trying to hear your sneak up the stairs yeah. while he in the room. <laughs> trying to listen who he on the phone with. That's, I found a lot of stuff out about from listening. <laughs> okay, and then I just wait. Like, is he going to tell me? What you doing tomorrow? <laughs> oh, nothing? Heard you got a studio session at night, though. <laughs> but okay, we're not going to talk about that. So, um, so I'm texting the sister, and I'm like, hey, da, 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 I'm going to come over, and uh, can you make sure it's, like, unlocked for me so I can just come in, yada, yada, yada. She's like, yeah, girl, I'm going to work, whatever. So I'm like, okay, cool. I come home, I get a ride over there, I go to the house, and when I open the door, I walk in, I go to you his room, happy. you know what I'm saying, I go to his room, and uh, I open the door, and when I open the door, him and some other girl are laying in the bed, yes, <laughs> they're oh laying in God, the bed like this, like, <gasps> like laid in the bed, covers on type of, 
watching Netflix on my Netflix account. <gasps> Yeah. They watching Netflix on your Netflix account. I'm my right? Netflix account. So he account. be thinking like, oh, she waiting in Michigan. Like, there's no yeah. way she could ever catch me. Exactly. So I'm like, <laughs> so I come in and I stand there, y'all. So this is how I knew, like, I don't know. I'm a, I'm a different, I don't know. I different opened the door and I said, and I walked away. But then I said, I went, so I went to like, I'm walking around the house. I'm like, okay, I'm tripping. Ain't no what airy. Ain't no way you just Y'all in a serious girl. relationship? Yes. I'm like, ain't no way it's another girl in this bed right now. There's no way. I would have went crazy. So then I go back in. I was like, he's going to lie to me. So I go back in the room. I'm like, hi. I'm sorry. Can I come in? And I flick the light on because it was, you know, lights are off. All of this. Oh, y'all. So, they were just Netflix and chilling. Netflix and chilling. What was going to happen? Real comfy. It's and a sign that kind of wanted to, like, I would be, like, playing the back of my head. Like, I wonder what would have happened if I would have just, like, stayed, like, stayed outside and just waited to see, like, when he came out the room. Like, what was going to happen before I came? So I come in and I sit down, like he had his little stool in his room. So I sat down across from the bed and I said, hi, what's your name? And she's like, Kaylee. I said, do you know who I am? And she's like, no. And I'm like, where did you meet him at? And she's like, oh, I met him last week at the, um, at the game. Mind you, this is my boyfriend, so we're talking. So when it's like a, I miss you when you're coming back. When are you going to come to this Indiana game? Because around Christmas time, they had this Christmas basketball tournament that oh. everybody goes to. So that's where they oh. met each other at. So I'm like, oh, really? But mind you, he was texting me like, I just miss you so much. I don't even want to be here. I'm just coming because my bro was playing. You know. Yeah, no. So I'm like, so maybe he met her there and was like, everything just changed. But we we've been good. This is like honeymoon times. So we good. So I'm like, the thing happened early. Yeah, it happened. I said, okay, cool. So then um, I'm talking to her and I was like, you know, you know those sheets and that blanket you're under. That's mine. And the Netflix account. That's mine too. And I was like, oh. And she had like candy too. And I said, ah, oh, that's my candy too. So I'm like, I give me a sucker and I'm like licking the sucker. And I'm like. And mind you, when I say that this man is still like this. Oh, so he just chilling. Like, he's not even nervous yeah, or nothing? He's not moving. Like, he's stuck. He's just laying there like this. Like, the he girl. He didn't is, give not two shit. Not two, not one, not two. The girl didn't set up already. Because she's talking to me like, oh, my God, I have no idea. She's like, what, what's going on? Coco, what the, what the f*** is going on? She was like. Yeah, she's looking at him like, what's going on? And she's like, I just met him. Honestly, I didn't even know about you. Like, we just met Friday. She was all proper. And so I said, so you just met this man, and you just going to come to his house? He probably and like, come chill bed. with me, come lay down with me, come for like Netflix and chill with I, me. I was, I was shocked and appalled. I what said, did you do, Eric? I would have just, I, I didn't do, I, all I did was I just waited, and I was like, okay. And I got up. And I was just like, oh, well, it's okay. You don't got to worry about it. She was, I was like, oh, you want me to cut the lights off? I was so nice. I really don't know why. I was just like, a, I just think I was just over it. Like, this is so stupid. Like, you're retarded. Like, you just cheated on me. You had this whole female. But I was really mad, so I waited until she left. This man you walked waited. her out. He walked her to her he car. He didn't give a F about you, Eric. And then when I wa looked in the, like, and I looked in the window to see, because I'm like, and she's like, well, I'm going to go. And I'm like. Oh, you don't gotta leave. I can cut the lights off. Y'all good? Finish what you doing? So they finished? No. She was like, Oh no, I'm just gonna go. And she's like, You're fucked up. She's talking. Oh, sorry, excuse me. Yeah. She's talking, <laughs> she's talking to him, to Coco. Uh -huh. And so he's still, he's still like this the whole time. So I leave. I sit there and I'm waiting. I'm like, I watch him leave. He takes her to the car. Now look at the window. She's parked up the street. Up the street, so you would have never seen, like, her car. Like, you know what I'm saying? And she's driving, so I'm like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm I'm, I'm airy in Indiana. Like, there was no YouTube going on. So I'm like, he comes back in the house, and I'm like, it's over. Don't ever talk to me again. Da, da, da. Next you know, <gasps> I love you so much. That's I'm what like, they no. all do. So why you ain't do that when I you just walk that girl it. outside? I said, but right when she like drove away and I'm watching, he's outside. He's like, ah! Coming up. He, I'm like, he was yelling. Over. He's screaming, yelling, crying, shaking. I was going to marry you. You are the woman of my dreams. I'm so sorry. I swear to God, I got a rape for you. It's, it, what's that? Ah! <laughs> I gave it to my mama to hold it because we had got into it that one time. But I swear to God, Eric, I can see myself marrying you. I love you. 
I'm like, it's over. Don't talk to me. So then I go in a room and I grab all of my stuff that was in there. Signed out of Netflix. And I'm like, don't ever talk I to me. I signed out of Netflix. So I went home and changed my password. <laughs> you want to watch Netflix on my account. I signed out. And then I left, and he was outside. I'm talking about on the ground in the driveway, like, oh, you know what I'm saying? Because I didn't already let my ride know, like, you know what I'm saying? Or did I drive? I feel like I might have had my mom's car. Somehow, I was able to leave when I was ready to leave. Mm -hmm. So I'm just sitting there, and I'm like, oh, I leave. I get all my stuff. I put it in the car. And I even told him to take myself to the car because I had a lot of stuff in there, like gifts that I had got, all of that. So I'm like, take this to the car. He's like, oh, my no. God. <laughs> Like, they don't know what they got until they lose. And I'm pulling off, and I was like, and so he in a, he, it's, but that say it was dark. I feel like it was dark. So he in there, like, he on the driveway, like, no, don't leave. And I'm backing up, like much. it's a movie or something. So I'm backing up, and I roll down the window. I said, go back in the house, nigga. Oh. Uh. <laughs> then he go in, he slammed the door, and then I left. And that Did was you ever talk to him again? Uh, No. No, I talked to him, like, a little bit after. Like, he had texted me and stuff, and I, like, texted him back. But it wasn't back on that, like, we're together, we're in love. It was like, that so was So, did you go back? No, I moved. Wow. <laughs> I moved. And now I'm in Houston. Niggas saying, cut it. Cut, cut the it. rap. Yep, so that's my story about what this time I got you to the, ah! <laughs> okay, so I feel like the story, I feel like I always tell the same story because it's just my biggest cheat scandal like I, it was just like my biggest cheat scandal and i just feel like i didn't really like experience like oh cheating on me like i just felt like oh he oh he all of a sudden messing with her but nobody really cheated on me how this dude cheated on me so i guess i'm gonna tell the story all yeah. over again so basically i was going with this boy and i feel i feel like it's karma because you know how you make a mistake and fall in love with somebody uh -huh. like so i feel like i made a mistake and started liking him a lot and, okay, so basically, we was in class or whatever, and he asked me to be, oh, that's a whole other fucking story. That's a whole other, <laughs> that's how, well, anyways, I didn't start liking him, and so he started bringing stuff to the table. Like, he got a car, so I'm like, oh, he got a car, Oh, right? he got a car, okay. So, I'm like, oh, okay, at this time, I'm like in, like, 10th grade, I don't, I'm not used yes. to dudes having For cars. For anybody watching this, so y'all don't even start judging, back in the day, if yeah. somebody had a car back in 10th, 11th, 12th grade, they was hot. popping. Exactly. So he had a car, and then we had this lunch period. I mean, not this lunch period. We had this class together, and he got off early because he was older than me. So he got out early. He had an off period in between his classes. Okay. So he had a car, and he was bringing me, like, Chick-fil-A and Canes. And at the time, y'all, I wasn't buying no Chick-fil-A and Canes. So Nobody I'm thinking, like... Was. Oh, Chick Fil A! <laughs> Chick Fil A gotta be expensive, cause my mama don't stop at Chick Fil A a lot. So, <laughs> so at the time, I'm like, oh, he bring, he must really like me. He bring me like at the time, my favorite candy was Lifesavers. I'm like, he bring me Lifesavers. He bring me Chick Fil A and Canes. Like, like you must got really like somebody yeah. to bring them Chick Fil A and Canes True. at the time. So basically, okay, so he just liking me and stuff like that. And then I didn't know the whole time that he had a girlfriend. But, or he was messing with some girl or whatever. So, when they ended up, like, me and him ended up really, really getting together, I guess he broke up with the girl. And then everybody used to tell me, like, even she was crazy. Like, even she used to be, like, really obsessed with him. Like, oh, dang. And he used to be saying, like, yeah, this girl just obsessed with me. Like, she keeps saying, like, people would come to me and be like, oh, you know that freaking Britney was at Marcus' house last night. And I'd be like, no, he wasn't because... He didn't tell me that. He called me. He told me where he was at. And they were like, yeah, well, I seen him over there. And then everybody be telling me stuff like that. But I was so in denial at the time. And then basically, she used to be like, do being real messy to me. Saying like, yeah, he be at my house. And he be sleeping with me and stuff like that. What? So was he she was older too? Huh? Was she older too? No, she was the same grade as me. Okay, okay. So, like, she was being all shaded to me, like, and she would just be talking about I just hear a whole bunch of stuff with her talking about me. So, I remember one day at lunch, I had went up to her, and she, I was like, was Marcus at your house last night? And she was like, what? What? And then I was, my sister was right behind me. I told my sister, she was like, I said, I'm fighting at lunch, so just be ready. <laughs> just be ready. <laughs> so, 
So I know I'm all over the place, so I'm trying to kind of like fast forward. So basically, he had been messing with her, but I never believed it. So then I told my sister, I'm like, I'm fighting at lunch. Just be ready. So she was like, okay. So I met her by my locker or whatever, and we put out. She put a book sack in my locker, and we walked over there. <laughs> Now that I think about it, we probably look at this so stupid. Oh my god. So I said, Was Marcus at your house last night? And she was like, What? 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 And I was like, Oh, okay. And I just walked up, but I left my sister. <laughs> so my sister was like, <laughs> And she said, Girl, why did you just leave me hanging like that? I was like, I had to make a dramatic exit. But anyways, <laughs> he was cheating on me with her. And who knows who else he was cheating on me with. But he was just cheating on me with her. And then he had went to, he was from another place, like another state. I feel like if I tell the state, he's just going to give it away. He was from another state. And once he graduated, like I said, he was older than me. So once he graduated, his dad lived in, I could say Virginia. His dad lived in Virginia. His mom lived in um, Baton Rouge. So he was living with his mama to go to school. But when he moved... To Virginia for the summer after he graduated. Uh -huh. Like, we was just FaceTiming. I was talking to him every day. But, you know, sometimes he'd be like, oh, I'm going to link with my old friends. I'm going to talk to my cousins and stuff like this. So, I'm like, okay, you know, go have fun. This, that, and the third. So, a girl DM me and said, you still mess with Marcus because I think I'm pregnant for him. Girl, and... Ooh. She started sending me a whole bunch of pictures of them, and he had outfits on that I had picked out for him on FaceTime. You know how you go, like, like, babe, you think you should put this on? I think oh, you should put this dang. on. Exactly. And I'm like, dang, I picked that outfit out, and I was on FaceTime with him that day. He hung up the phone on my face, and now it's all making sense. So, oh, snap. It was all making sense, y'all. And then I was just heartbroken. Like, I was just crying. I felt like I was just in one of those teen movies. And I was like, what is this happening to me? I was sitting in my bed. And then at the time, like, I had found out at like 2 o'clock in the morning. So, like, literally, I'm just, like, sitting there. He calling my phone, crying, saying all I want is you and stuff like that. And I'm just, like, sitting under my covers crying, <laughs> like, denying his call. But I was still answering sometimes, like, what? <laughs> dramatic like you know how you act like you don't want to talk to somebody <laughs> no 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 I understand exactly what you are talking about you want about. them to know that you're hurting that you're crying <laughs> so you answer the phone <laughs> listen I didn't call I didn't call them before I didn't call them before cause I okay that's a whole other story no, that's you gotta other... feel it. okay cause listen this one time me and one of my boyfriends had got into an argument and I went six days without talking to them so I'm, like, I'm not talking to them. They need to realize that they lost the good one. <laughs> they never hit me up. <laughs> so I called. I said, I called and I let it like ring one time, hung up. So mm -hmm. then I called again. I'm like, because at first I'm like, Ari, you don't know if he going to really answer or not. You really don't know. And so I waited. And so I called again. He answered. He was like, what's up? I said, hey. Hey, what's up? I said, What's up? You ain't talked to me in six days and you talk about some what's up. Next thing I just start going off. I'm like, I just don't understand. I have to give every part of me. And you talking about in the six days and you living your best life. I see your Instagram. I see your bro snapping. And then come to find out, he was like, oh, I'm in the middle of something. I'm just, come on, we can talk about it later, bro. And I'm like, no, you don't appreciate me. You don't even know my words. I'm over this. It's over. It's done. back <laughs> he didn't answer so then i kept calling then he put his phone on airplane mode or do not disturb or whatever and i went to voicemail and then that was it you now call he never talked to you again he called me he called me like the day the next day apparently he was trying to vibe it out and i don't know but wow. come to find out i found out like i found out like a like uh i found out later that he was playing 2k when i called so when he was like, I'm in the middle of something, it's just not the right time, he was playing 2K. Wow. But I didn't talk to him so for two 2K days. and more important to me, and you've been playing 2K these whole six days that you've been talking to me, but all of a sudden you can't hold on, pause the game. Yeah, so don't tell me when you see me with my new boyfriend talking about, oh, y'all cute, I see exactly. y'all video. I bet you did. Exactly. I bet you did see the video. Because I tagged you in it. Horror story, I was heartbroken. I thought my heart was broken, y'all. I literally thought that this was it. <laughs> I thought this was it. But guess what? Swain came to save the day. Save the day. Uh, yes. So, that is crazy. Y'all, so that's about... <laughs>
<laughs> that's our story time about the first time we got cheated on. And if y'all got cheated on, I'm trying to tell y'all this right now. Listen, it hurt. It's a lesson to be learned. But you will be okay. Like, honestly, like, you're going to be okay. Like, you are genuinely going to be okay. It just seemed dramatic at the moment. You might think yeah. you love that boy, but you don't love that boy. Yes. If it's not a ring on your finger, sis, stop crying. Exactly. Okay, like, stop stressing about all of that stuff. Just live your best life. You do not need to wait until 2021 or 2027 to say, new year, new me, to do what I feel like I should do. Do it now. Okay? Because I'm telling you, nobody cares about what you're doing. All people going to say is like, oh... Like, she looks like she's living her best life. You are. Or, exactly. oh, you know what I'm saying? But they still going to go with their day-to-day life. Mm-hmm. Stop thinking about what other people think. Like, stop overthinking that. Just go with the flow. And if he cheat on you, go with his cousin. So you can still go to his the family reunions. You know what I'm saying? And the good thing. <laughs> uh, I'm just saying. It's up to you. It's all about your own personal preference and how you I wouldn't it. judge. I don't judge at all. Do exactly. your thing, sis. I just don't feel like the need to judge is important. But if y'all want more talks and things like that and different topics, make sure y'all go send us some suggestions down below and to our DMs and follow us on our social media. Neek's uh, channel link will be down below. Life with Neek will be down below. Stay tuned because we got some more tea coming for y'all and some bangers. And we're out. Ah, Peace. peace. Ah.